Hello, dear viewer, and welcome to Athenian on iOS. It's a free-to-play kind of tile placement game. Yeah, I, I think showing you will be probably the best thing to do. There are, of course, in-app payments you can do. You can buy diamonds and things and cards. So I really don't know how much the game uh, helps you when you're free to play. I've played with each deck archetype so far. At first I played against just random casual matches, but they do have a solo mode that you can enter that you can try out every deck archetype. And it's pretty interesting, like uh, some of them you have to link the tiles together with arrows, others can lock out parts of the map, etc, etc. So they're pretty fun. Let's try the Link deck archetype. I haven't messed with any of the decks or anything. I don't know what else to call them since it's like a pile of tiles, I guess. I think they consider it a card game. We'll play a casual match. Yep, yep. So I've almost played with every deck twice. Uh, overall, it's a pretty fun game. I think it's probably Athenion, not Athenian. That would be a citizen of Athens. So yeah, it's only ever taken me about that long to do stuff. Here's some of the artwork style. It's kind of an anime art style. But I figured you all might enjoy kind of seeing how this game works. Because the mechanics are interesting. I don't know how balanced the game is. Okay, we've got a 1 cost, 2 cost, a 1 cost, 2 cost. Uh, we don't care about the last wish freeze. That's a death rattle, basically. Linking is good. Awaken. Yeah. We'll just replace that one. As you wish. Let's fight. Oh, I didn't click OK. Well, learn that. So you can click on your character, Hello there. do emotes. Okay, so as you see, ooh, that's a good card, the Warwolf. So, you have three mana every turn. That's it. Some of them, like this, since I'm going a second, I basically get an extra mana. Okay, gain plus two power for each other unit in the same link. I can only go left, right, and up. Okay, I don't think I have anything that can take on the Warwolf, so we're not going to worry about it. Okay, we are going to do this next. So here's the link. There we go. And then I can do one more. I could go out there. Yeah, we'll do this. Now, the way attacking works is it all depends on where people are placed and stuff like that. So right now we've made this thing a lot more powerful. We don't have anything to attack. But you may notice this number to the left of my hero is a four. And the left of his was a three. He dealt three damage to us because he's got something on the board that has three soul power. Right now, we have four soul power on the board, but he's taking care of that. Okay, and we froze the dumb thing. All right. Freezing basically means when it takes damage, it won't attack back. But there we go. That got rocked. All right, we always draw back up to five. All right. A merman champion. Okay. So Link is nice because it's not just like a battle cry or Awaken effect. A lot of these have Awakens like this guy. Okay, a giant swordfish. So we can deal a lot of damage to the wolf if we wish. Now, of course, the arrows dictate which way people can attack and Link. Uh, right now I don't have anything going diagonal. So yeah, I think we may... Yeah, okay. We're going to do something a little dumb. Boink. Boink. I challenge you. So now they're all linked together. Well. That didn't go quite as well as I hoped. We'll go. Dang. <laughs> I guess the uh, timing of the placing of the swordfish matters. So that's a thing. Apparently, oh, this one doesn't have Link, that's why. Nice so, this will probably be the first game I've lost. I am sad. But yeah, the game's tutorial is minor, and then it kind of throws you into that screen. But you can click on that solo text, and it'll take you to that place where you learn how to do stuff. Wizard Man Champion. And that sounds good. Do we have anything that can just die to that guy? Okay. Looks like it's working again. But we can use this Merman Champion. Even 
And as you can see, we get our link abilities, and this guy can't attack us back. We're at the side. So we're a little bit better protected here. We are losing significantly right now. I would like to take out the wolf at some point. We will probably do this and then be able to take out the wolf without changing it. Okay. Now, because he placed that, these two are going to attack each other. Oh, and I'm going to lose my really good character. Okay. Goodbye, good merman champion. Right. Well, there goes that plan. Okay. Hmm. Alright. So I think what we're going to do is this. It's going to give it to that one since that's the only one of ours out there. And then we can play this guy. And we can cover stuff. So since we can't take out the wolf just yet, we'll take out everything else. It's the only way to stem the tide of damage! Oh well. We'll compliment. Wise. And they do have some animations, of course. I'll show you how to win. Hmm. Well, how rude. You usually want to try to set it up so that it's a bad idea for your opponent to attack in your weak spots. Yeah, well, I don't think I did that very successfully. Thankfully, he did put this boar where this thing, or I'm sorry, that's the rushing rabbit. It's a beautiful rabbit. Okay. So we want you out here. We want this thing to die. Singer frog. Jellyfish girl. Oh, we can get uh, armor. That's pretty good. We can't play lizard man champion. We'll do this. So armor sticks around forever. It just decreases damage by one at the moment, since I have one armor. So that's definitely not going to save my Spectre Hydrozoa. Nor do I want it to be saved. For I want it to freeze the wolf so I can take it down. Nick. However, there's a very high chance, because his deck is based off the Berserk class, that, uh, yeah, we're going to lose all of our characters and links. I feel like this is a good counter to the Link deck. Just fast aggression. Prevent them from building the Links. Because if you can build all the Links up, you get some crazy combos. Ah, that uh, Awaken gave me minus damage. So this thing's going to almost kill that, but not quite. And she doesn't get the armor, apparently. Yep, we're losing, it looks like. Okay. Plus two health, but no plus attack, eh? Okay. Well. Hmm. I kind of need to kill the big thing. So I think we're just going to do this for now. And hope this works out. He's pretty much going to be able to just kill it. Which is bad. But hey, at least we take out one card. And probably a second one. Oop. Yeah. Lion Warrior. Well, this person has played well. Good work. Okay. And of course, since we didn't play as many tiles, or cards, I should say, then, uh, yeah, we don't draw as many. There is a limit of 40 cards per deck. Let's see, Tundra Warrior. We can take out that guy. Okay. So we have three ones we could do. All right. So let's do something like bam, bam. The cold never bothered me. We could do this. We have to get it to this guy, and there we go. 
We can't take out the Russian Ravagers yet. But we'll see how this goes. Yep. If I can build the links, though, then this might work out still. Nobody else has link. Alright. Oh, he's actually going to destroy that for me. That's kind of nice. So the rabbits are dealing some damage, but they're not super tough. Okay, yeah, we got that one. Okay. Hmm. So, what we're going to do... Yeah, we will do this, Need a hand? and this. That's not the best thing ever, but it'll work. Alright, so then we can try to link other things to this one in the future. It's protected if somebody tries to t attack diagonally there, and there. The the they can attack each other thing. Pomola Flame Summoner. Right. If we can destroy each of these monsters before his turn, then he won't be able to deal soul point damage to us. Okay. Now we don't have anything that can attack diagonally. So I think we just sacrifice a Tundra Warrior here. Yep. They're cold. Never bothered me. And then we give both of them more stuff, actually. Let's see, you don't have Link, so we'll actually place you... No, we'll still place you here. It's bad that we're keeping the Link from working, but it's good that we're buffing both of them. And this person can still attack in this guy's blind spots. So, okay. We're protecting our guys a little bit better now. Maybe we can pull this out of the fire. Maybe. Maybe not. Giant wolf, no! Okay. Hmm. So... We got this guy. Batman champion. And we can go in the wolf's weak spot. Actually. Yeah, okay. So we'll do... this. That may not be the best spot ever, but it prevents us from getting hurt, which is really the main thing now. And then since it's in a corner, we can build around it and protect it. And then he keeps taking damage. That I think is probably the best strategy in the game, is build a base and then surround it. Right now this guy's going to take out both my little dudes. This one will also go down. Unless that happens. Okay, then. That's a good combo, because the Berserk gave her more health. Alright. Hmm. So we want to KO that one. Okay. So... This is somewhat unfortunate. But I think we have to do this and the Slinger Funk. Okay. I challenge you. Yeah. So then I'll KO that character. We'll take less damage person in the corner should be easier to take down. Okay. If we can buff this thing ever, then yeah. He can protect this guy. But right now, nope. Yep. Place very well there. But took away something that was dealing damage to us. Alright. Hmm. 
So, we pretty much need this. There we go. And there we go. No, we can't really risk it. So we'll put her here. Need a hand? That's not great. It forces a link to the right. I could have put her in a better spot, but this way she doesn't take damage, and it's harder to remove her. Well, that's what I'm thinking, anyway. Okay, but that happened. Hmm. So we'll deal four damage. Do we have a way to remove it? We do. Okay. So, we can try to set up a link. I think this will work. Yeah, it's probably dangerous, though. Let's try it. Is this what I think it is? Yes, it is! Beautiful. Okay. Alright. And then we need to try to get her linked more. But yeah. So now we're pretty even right now. Oh, and he's got two armor, so he's not going to take too much damage. And he gets plus two power each turn, which is pretty good for him, not us. Okay. And he didn't even take damage. Hmm. Lame. Okay. For each other unit in the same link. Gain plus two health. So he'll be okay for now. That'll deal some damage. Okay. But for now, this is very close as a game. We will see how this goes. Narada won't be able to deal enough damage. Yep. That armor. Oh, man. You win, my friend. Oh! We win! He couldn't remove us in time. Woo! And that's why I think building a base around a corner is pretty good. I am not certain once again how balanced the game is, but it seemed pretty good there. So, yeah. I've enjoyed my time with Athenian. Leave a like if you have enjoyed this video. Subscribe to see more iOS gaming videos. Comment below on if you want to see more Athenian, because I am enjoying it. And have a great day, dear viewer.